outside filming, ironically, from a Caesars property, Paris, about uh, MGM poker comps. Because I got a couple things. I got like one thing wrong, one thing I just didn't mention, and one thing I also didn't mention, but if I said it, I probably would have been a little wrong. So some viewers, thanks viewers, told me of the things that I got wrong, and here are the corrections. So the thing I got wrong is how the comps expire. Every day you earn comps, those comps last for one year. If you play on August 1st, for example, those comps expire the following August 1st. Playing again on August 5th does not reset all of them. So every single day has its own expiration date. Not how it works at Caesars at all, and it never mattered to me, because when I play, I play consistently, and uh, the couple times in my life I've left for a long time, I just use up all my comps before I leave. I don't like keep a bunch and then come back several months later and uh, wonder if they're still there or not. And that's kind of annoying because a lot of people come to town like the same time every year for like a birthday, an anniversary, a holiday, something like that. So if you come to town and like you played like August 1st, 2nd, 3rd, poker in Bellagio, and the next year you come to town on the 4th, all your comps are expired. So use them up before you leave town. Uh, the trip in which you earn them. The one thing I didn't mention, but I probably would have gotten a little wrong, when you ask a floor to print out a comp, you say, can I have a comp for $20? And the floor prints something out and signs it and like keeps up half of the piece of paper for um, their records and they give you the other half to use at the restaurant. There's gonna be an expiration date on that piece of paper. It's either 24 hours or 48 hours in the future. I've been told from viewers, if you don't use it, and you bring it back before the expiration date, the floor can put those comps back on your account. If you don't use it and you go back to the floor slightly after the expiration date, if it's like the right floor on the right day and you're very polite about it, they nice. sometimes do, but I wouldn't uh, be 100% confident that that's gonna happen. So if you get it printed out, look at the expiration date and probably just use it before the expiration date. You have one or two days. And the one thing I just didn't mention in that video is comps you earn playing poker in MGM Vegas properties are only good in that property. When you play poker at Bellagio, you earn comps. You can only use those comps in Bellagio, not another MGM property. So if there's one day you play five hours at Bellagio and you play three hours at Aria, now you have $10 in comps at Bellagio because it's $2 an hour. You have $6 in comps at Aria because it's also $2 an hour over there. You do not have 16 comps at MGM properties. You have 10 exactly to use at Bellagio and you have six exactly to use at Aria. It's only one physical card you need. You use the same card when you go play either poker room and they swipe you in. You only need one card in your wallet, but they know where you earn the comps and you can only use the comps where you earn them. Not at all like Caesars Palace, uh, like Caesars Entertainment Properties. So those are the three things. Some were wrong, some were just left out. Um, I'm gonna put the link to the Caesars video back at the top because that everything was right. Caesars is much easier to look up and know what the rules are and like read the fine prints and everything. So everything I said about Caesars properties uh, was correct. So if you wanna go back, watch that video, everything's right. And if you wanna know the information about MGM properties, uh, this is the video with the more accurate information than the last video. And I know there are a lot of uh, new subscribers in the past month or so. So Q and A opportunity, question and answer. Uh, if you want to leave a question, go to my YouTube homepage, go to the communities tab, and then the multiple choice is uh, just a joke. Uh, just leave a comment with your question. No guarantee I answer every question, no guarantee uh, I even read every single one. I don't know how many there are gonna be, and I might just be unwilling to answer the question, but I'll get to a lot of them, and that's about it. And remember, rice is a spoon food.